previously on Quantum Conundrum. Oh, that uh, creature there is an interdimensional kinetic entity, or hype. Mm -hmm. It's not as yellow as here. Like Dolly, technology powered by uh, the yellow stuff. Bird, also powered by yellow stuff. It stays yellow. But why? Though, technically, this also stays yellow. But it's not liquid, so... Is it the same liquid? Okay. It's one piece of my latest invention that should come in handy. Get it? You know, because it's a glow. <laughs> yeah. I don't remember it being that far since the weird... Weird reference. One can never be too safe. Pun, pun, pun. Too safe. Well played. Two shots. Okay. Flushing sound? Oh. Time to spring into action. <laughs> I crapped myself up. Uncle, I didn't know you uh, were with child. Happy for you, Uncle. Happy for you. And, uh, d d d d give me a moment. Oh, no, 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 no. We're not starting again. <laughs> All right. Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Tyler Troni, and welcome back to Quantum Conundrum. Last time, we've actually finished... Finished, uh, turning on the uh, generator. And we are back here. With, uh, the giant stretchable doggo. That wasn't so bad, was it? It was fine. And hey, hello. Can I open it now? I'm not entirely sure. Hey, you found something. Try not to break too much. Okay. Like <clears throat> I, I I kind of remembered while editing and going through it, like uh, the previous episode. Like, I've unlocked this area. Like, I grabbed the, the actual key thing. What is this, though? We're not gonna go there just yet. We're like, at, at the end, after we've started it up, the other thing, we'll go and check that out because I I have no idea what what that place is. I don't even think I've. I, I'm not sure if I've ever actually been there before. Okay, so <clears throat> a few things that I've noticed once I've actually uh, edited uh, episode one. Uh, <laughs> when uh, when uh, Uncle said his uh, Mr. Quidrangle said his dad joke, I, I forgot to point out that he was doing it dad joke with, you know, handy, and I, I just literally uh, said, oh, I didn't know you were a child, which is, like, I mean, so, some people might have caught 
the joke, but at the same time, it's... It's weird. <laughs> it, it's uh, definitely not the best joke. Um, this is this is what you get from this channel. Uh, so some sometimes you you get some <clears throat> mindless mindless jokes that just like pop up. Uh, it's like it's been a while. Like I said at the beginning. Uh, like, wait, have I said this at the beginning? I might I might have said this at the beginning. I might have said this in another let's play. Like I'm editing, uh, I'm kind of like working on two let's plays at the same time. <clears throat> but it, it's a little rusty after all these years of not doing Let's Play videos, so... Anyway, they, they, there's also another book that's after finally, like, like B. Watt, that I've mentioned previously. Like, I, I, my brain, like, while edi editing, kind of realized, like, oh, no, it's B. O. Watt. It's Beowulf. It's most likely Beowulf. So... Anyway, uh, le uh, let's go. Let's go. Oh, let's continue. Splendid. It seems as if the power is starting to come back online. Yeah. As I still haven't been able to figure out how to get out of here, you'll have to make it to the <clears> next <throat> generator. You can access the next wing of the manor and the power grid sector by heading up the stairs there. No problem. Wait. I do find it kind of funny that, like, I'm assuming this is like an actual signature from an, the artist that worked on these paint things. doesn't say NASA. I don't think so. Like, the letters are off. But it looks like NASA. NASA. K Is this the second floor? It's, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm getting there. I'm getting that there. Badly. I'm getting there. I'm just... I'm just, I'm just like, li li listen. Listen, listen, listen. I'm getting there. Fisher Michelson. One of the initial major investors in Quadrangle Industries. Mm -mm. I'm... Hesitant to admit it, but many of my grander inventions would not have been possible without his support. The fact that it's done more realistically, I almost feel like... That is my second cousin, Billy. Uh -huh. He's always been enamored with the fiction found between the covers of a book. He decided to model his life on his favorite stories. No one saw him after this particular plot line. Moby Dick. The fact that the two paintings with a more realistic looking art style actually have dialogue makes me think that these are actually based off of real people. Also, how, how? Like, you can clearly see the entire house in this painting. Like, how many... Like, you, you are playing a game of... Uh, Hopefully it won't be too much trouble how, how to did you the next generator. Like, all these corridors. Like, I'm sure if someone were to actually map out the entire thing, like, all the corridors and everything, I, I don't think it would actually make and sense. And perhaps I can find a way out of here. This is getting rather ridiculous. Understandable. The dog is stretching all the way to, uh... <coughs> Whoops. Stretching all the way to the fish. Oh, new... In case you are wondering about the pneumatic transportation tubes around the manor, they are filled with the same science juice that is in all the IDS batteries. I was able to extract the base material for the science juice from a um, undisclosed biological source. Okay. 
So, what I was remembering was from this moment. <clears throat> Undisclosed biological source. So, assuming that it's Ike. Like, it most likely is Ike. <clears throat> and it's yellow. Which... I mean, I guess it could be yellow bile. What's what's yellow bile? Greenish yellow bile made up of uh, gallbladder, stored in the gallbladder. Hmm. But yeah, I have. I'm almost like I. I don't know how immature the world is. But th the fact that it's of yellowish color in the in the main dimension, and it's from a biological source, the only known biological um, source that's able to travel through all well travel exists through all of the dimensions is Ike, meaning that it's maybe. Maybe. Some sort of fluid that does come from Ike. <clears throat> Are we in the... This is the... Uh... Basement? Like, honestly, see, like, like, we've seen the portrait of how this place looks like. Okay, uh, uh, If only you could see the look on your face right now. I hope that you've been able to glean that the time in this next dimension is protracted, causing everything to move in slow motion. Yeah. I was scared for a moment there. I was like, wait a minute, where am I? I'm already seeing the, um, the next dimension. Great. So yeah, so yeah, so it is what I remembered. Slow dimension, heavy dimension, fluffy dimension. Up. Oh, I overjumped it. Okay. How am I supposed to do this? Like a pan dimensional button. Mm hmm. <laughs> How am I over jumping this? Like oh. a pan dimensional Ooh, boy. That was my mistake. Like a pan dimensional bunny rap. Okay, I I think I know what the issue is. I shouldn't be uh jumping straight. Should be probably jumping in angles. Like a pan dimensional bunny. Okay, maybe not.
Interesting. Uh, <laughs> like a pan-dimensional bunny rabbit, hopping across a landscape of quantum fields. Are you kidding me on the sofa? <laughs> on the sofa, the longest. Of boys. Really? <laughs> okay. <clears throat> you almost... You, you, you were at the halfway mark, so... Like a pan-dimensional bunny rabbit, hopping across a landscape of quantum fields. I think the issue is... Eating two entire cakes. True. <clears throat> Uh, never would do that. Two entire cakes at once? Like a pan-dimensional bunny rabbit, hopping across a landscape of quantum fields. Poetry. <sighs> okay. <laughs> the issue is... Not that everything is slow, but gravity, like I've mentioned before, for ju just just from jumping, you can kind of see there's like a a bit of a lift to it. It's not like perfect. Heavy battery here? I'm not entirely sure where Desmond is in this area. So I, I I keep having to like jump forward, but like pressing back just one bit just to make sure that I am uh Well oh, hey. um, one of my first victories. Good old things. My pet pug. He was either extremely brilliant or possessed with the intelligence of a brick. He would also eat pretty much anything shiny. Sometimes the act of slowing things down would reveal the correct path. Whew. Okay. I'm assuming we have to go... yeah. Oh, wait. Heavy now. Okay. <laughs> no. <clears throat> Finding yourself. Whew. Okay. Okay. The first building raised on quadrangle land wasn't much to look at. Quadrangle. But I can assure you, the pipework was something impressive. Quad. Far ahead of its time. Really? Quadrangle. 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 Triangle. To quadrangle. <clears throat> Quadrangle. 
Over the years, the Quadrangles expanded their living quarters. Though I should add that at this point, no one in the family had been exposed to any significant quantities of radiation. Mm. Significant. Is that the keyword here? Like, even looking at... Eh, I don't know who that artist is, but, you know, they do a good job. Like, I don't know if, uh... Have I mentioned that the manor requires a lot of ventilation? No shit. No shit. Of course. Careful. The blades are rather sharp. I bet. Oh no. Okay, I recognize well, this place. It's probably not the best location for you. But sadly, it's rather unavoidable. I would move if I were you. Can I die from jumping too high? Because right right now I, I saw like the screen glitch, you know the same. What a disappointing hiding spot. Was it? Yeah. Step off now. I s mm. so close. <laughs> I would move if I were you. Oh. Okay. Step off now. Okay. <laughs> oh, I mean, in my defense, I just. just I was thinking a little too much ahead. <laughs> Okay, next. Whew. We got this. Alright. Oh. Moving out. Okay, where do I have to go? 
Was I too fast? I think I was too fast. Oh, wait. Okay, I have to stay on the... Uh I think I have to stay on the front couch. Oh. Oh. No, so close. Build a mansion that some kid gets stuck in. I do like that you have like a bunch of uh oh. 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 <laughs> I keep dying <sighs> I miss fluffy in a heavier dimension. <laughs> Actually, Okay. Second couch. Jump on the first one. You should be able to fit through. Don't forget to breathe. It's an important aspect of life. Yeah. Yeah. Whew. Really? They just stay there. <laughs> 